Hello Terraria tubers, and welcome back to Let's Play Terraria with the Metroid mod pack and me, Blue Inkilo. So things may look a little different. Um, the wise ones among you probably already realized last episode that I somehow managed to corrupt my world. So yeah, it wasn't working. It didn't save or something. I don't know what I did, but my character was fine. So I just made a new world and I had to make a few until I got another snow one because I decided I must have a snow world and there's no bunnies allowed. <laughs> so anyway, welcome back. And for today's episode, we're just gonna cruise around. We need to get um, materials. I managed to get, you know, a bit of gold and silver and iron and stuff, but we don't have a whole lot, and we need to make, uh, I guess we're aiming towards our first boss fight already, so I need to find a cave and work my way down, because I know if you get uh, deep enough, you'll get a, the, the eye will be summoned anyway, right? And I'm pretty sure we're strong enough to go quite a long ways underground, but we are a little bit low on um, uh, picks and stuff, we don't have very, str we still have a copper pick, yeah wooden hammer. Pretty lame. But yeah, so this is a new world. I don't know where anything is again. That first episode was, I'm going to call it an intro video. I'm sure you guys already have seen it and sort of call it a write-off just as a uh, intro to the game and you get to watch me fool around uh, trying to tweak my inventory and stuff so that it uh, <laughs> it works the way I want it to. But anyway, uh, quality YouTubers here. YouTube performance. Anyway, so we've got, we've got Samus. We've got our power suit. We've got our... Uh, whatever they called it, the first gun, the power beam, except that it's lethargic and lame, but uh, at least we can shoot birds out of the sky <laughs> in the bloody gory. Um, we are pretty overpowered for early game stuff, which is fine. Nobody nobody minds, right? So, oh, also the map size is small, in case you're wondering, so that's why I ran into the jungle this quickly, um, which sure, why not? Let's go check out the jungle, why not? Let's just go wherever the heck the game takes us. I, I don't even know where I am. Uh, like I said, it's a new world, and we've got the we've got the uh, we've got the power suit. We'll be fine. What can what can happen to us in the cursed jungle? Those wasps will be no match for our power beam. It's not a very good power beam, um, but it's ranged, uh, so that's good. Oh, well, this is a pretty lousy jungle. Is that really all I get? It's like. A little bit of iron. I guess I'll pick it up. I still... I Well, actually, I need some stone and stuff. I need to make my... Uh, all the basic stuff I forgot about. I have to make my... Uh, well, what's it called? You know, the, the smelter. Stuff like that. You know, I should never have this power suit um, without having them working away to the, the meteor. But I just figured, you know, going through all that early on beginner stuff, I don't know, I just wasn't quite up for it. Doesn't, oh, it does go somewhere up there. All right, let's go up there. I quite like this power beam. Who cares about being overpowered? It's a mod. It's supposed to be overpowered. <laughs> so yeah, hope you guys enjoy this Let's Play. Um, I always said I would come back to Terraria, and I meant it, so uh, here you are. I kind of got stuck on that Borderlands one. I'm having a hard time finishing it, but uh, almost got it now. Almost done. Okay, this is dead end. I'm not here. I don't even feel like mining uh, copper. It's no point. So we'll get a little bit more iron. I do need. I need to make a new anvil because I lost that. So I need a bit of iron for that. Oh, cobwebs are good too, right? I gotta make a bed. Ah, uh, Terraria with Super Metroid stuff. Pretty cool, huh? Pretty happy. Yeah, those guys are pretty tough. All right. So overall plans for this mod, uh, or for this series, I don't know. Um, I would like to show off, or at least um, get through, I would like to have all the items uh, from the from the Metroid mod pack. Um, I know that was kind of one of my goals from the Omnir series, that I couldn't really attain, because it got, so many of them were just uh, really rare drops from, from enemies, that uh, it was just going to take forever to get every single item, so there was no way that was going to happen. But I think in this one, it's much more simple matter of just, you know, mining enough, you know, meteorite, for instance. And then you can just make all your various, uh, the various tools and armor and all that good stuff. So it shouldn't be too hard. And um, also, as I think the, the mod is still um, under construction or whatever, under development. 
but I don't think it's kind of like Omnir's where there was new 5% drops every week or two there, every week or two there. So I don't think I'll be so, I don't think I'll get stuck so far behind on the loot. At least I hope not. <laughs> um, I, uh, I forgot to mention in the first video, but, um, definitely a big shout out to the creator of the mod and I actually, oh, I was just looking at the forum thread. I should remember this guy, Scooter or something? I'll have to double check. Um. I'll, I'll make a bit proper shout out in the next episode or something. Because um, this is a pretty cool idea. I, I like the idea of a uh, Metroid Terraria, so thanks, dude. Um, can I wear two aglets? No. So I've got one damage or defense. Let's keep defense. Just throw this away. Shine potion and uh, some stuff here. We've got some good stuff. Shurikens, yeah. I guess I'll bring another chest home. I don't need all that many, but that'll be the third one, so it's probably a good idea. Um, but yeah, if, if you're wondering, I'll leave, uh, I'll leave a link in the description for the last couple of videos, the first few videos, to the thread. And, um, I mean, installing it's as easy as anything. Um, it's just like most tconfig mods, you install tconfig and then you put the, uh, mod file in the right folder and it just works. So, it's pretty easy if you're trying to install it yourself. I guess the jungle is still a little bit difficult with this little gun. But, um, I think we're doing okay. I see gold. Is that gold? That's no, iron. And do I need the iron? I wouldn't mind getting like a golden pickaxe or something. That would speed this up a lot. But uh, I don't want to waste too much early game. I want to get to the new stuff. The mod stuff. Yeah. Uh, so it looks like this is kind of a not a good area to go. Maybe. Oh. Ooh, new metal, new ore. So that's cool. Uh, I'll just remember that for later, maybe. No idea what that is, but uh, something. Might be uh, light ore or dark ore or something, I don't know. Those would be like from Metroid Prime 2 or something, I don't know. I kind of get the feeling that I might not be actually strong enough to go through the jungle just yet. Uh, just by how much damage this thing does. It's nice for long range, and it's pretty fast, but uh, it doesn't really do very much damage. So maybe I'll get out of here. Try to kill some eyeballs and uh, maybe get the Eye of Cthulhu fight. That would be good enough, right? That, that would be a good goal for today's episode. Eye of Cthulhu. What do you guys think? I need to find a... Uh, uh, whatever. The, the demon altars first. got to find one of those or else it doesn't even matter. No full damage! <laughs> I thought I was dead for a second and then I'm like... Oh, yeah. So this is an odd little hole. Um, very strange. Golden chest! Regeneration ring! Oh, we're doing good! Oh, there's more of that stuff. Alright, we're going to the jungle anyway, after all. Alright, so let's kill stuff, let's head on down. So what is this? Oh, oh, yeah, oh, okay, it's bad stuff. Ha <laughs> ah, ha! I'm on to your tricks, game. There's a lot of that in the jungle, wow. Wasn't expecting to find so much of this new stuff. How much iron do you think I really need? Like, let's be honest here. What do I need it for? I need an anvil. I guess an iron pick is better than what I've got right now, but not for very long. Do I need it for anything else? I might need it for, like, missiles or something. Yeah. So let's pick up some iron. I don't know all the recipes just yet. I haven't really looked them up or anything. Um, as always, uh, a shout out to RWM, because he was the one who... Oh, thanks, Steam. I'm going to turn Steam off. Um, Sorry, whoever you are, for having you show up here. That wasn't the intention. I have to make sure I shut that off next time. Um, shout out to RWM um, for... Uh, he was the one that... Uh, he made a spotlight video on this uh, this mod, and that got me interested in it and checking it out. So, uh, yeah, he got me into another one. Good old RWM. Showing me all the cool mods for Terraria that I didn't know about. Um, so, yeah, that, that's, you know, that's the way it goes. Um... I will be doing a lot more off-camera stuff. And this is going to take a little while. Um, another golden chest. Wow, we're really lucky with chests today. Um, assuming I can survive and get down there. These things are pretty tough. I don't want to just jump down there and get killed yet. Okay, we need a new gun. Or we need missiles or something. Missiles require the magic missile um, spell, I believe. I was looking at the recipe and meteorite. So, uh, unfortunately, we have to get to the dungeon for that to work. Alright. Oh, good. Poison. Kill them all. Actually, what I would really like is my, uh, uh, 
grappling hook. So if I could get a, a whatever it's called, you know, hook and all that chain. That's what I need the iron for. Um, once I get the better power-ups from this, uh, I won't be using it very much because there'll be some Metroid-y ways to get around. Um, but early on, I'm going to use stuff like the Hermes boots. Wow! Well, thank you, game. Some silver, some shurikens again, some bombs. That's... I guess I should take these with me, actually. Don't you start not letting me pick stuff up again. I fixed that problem. What? Something is wrong. Okay, if you guys know what the deal is with that. If my game doesn't save what happens again. No, it did. I double checked. Before I started recording this episode, I made sure it would save changes. Like, the reason the first episode, the reason I had to use a new map was it wasn't actually keeping the changes I made to the world. But this one, I already double checked. It does that. If I lose all my world, I'm going to be upset. Um, but yeah, it's... Okay, now it's not picking up items either. Uh, maybe there's like an option or something I've, I've turned on that I don't know about. My inventory is not full. Weird. I've never had this happen. Is it part of the mod, maybe? Alright, those things, I'm gonna just leave them alone, mostly. Oh, deep enough to get spores and piranhas. Piranhas can drop uh, those hooks, right? Rare label. Alright, so if that, uh, oh, it's one of those things. But I need to breathe! I need to breathe! Let's, uh, yeah, do that. And try to pick up some silver! Uh, I don't think I have any glow sticks, so this is gonna be very dark, sorry. Sorry for the darkness. I'll shoot every now and then, just to see what's going on. <laughs> Actually, what I need to do is breathe again. The water is taking a long time to, uh, leave this area. So maybe what I should do is see if I can mine that out. There you go. Look at that. Talent. Blue Ankylo has got some skills. <laughs> uh, all right. What I really want was that silver. A silver pickaxe would be a good upgrade. Look at us going to the... Going to, actually, what I should do I should make a little breathing hole. I forgot about that. I'm not going to have enough time. I can't see anything. Okay, there. I got a little torch in. Now I got to go breathe. <laughs> uh, this, this is good. 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 Breathe. It's just taking a little bit longer for the water to drain out. That's the problem. It's starting to come down. At least I can see where I'm digging now. I should have thought of that earlier. The old dig a hole, put a torch in it magically. Yeah, look at that water coming down. Right, we got lots of silver. This is good. Good times. Good times, everybody. We're actually going to need more... Um, we're going to be low on stone to make our uh, first... Um, whatever it's called. Smelter. So yeah, um, I don't know how much of this I'm going to record. I figured the first couple episodes I'd record most of my play. Just because it's kind of new for me and new for you guys. But um, once things get into that swing of things, you know, I mean... I can gather up silver on my own. You guys don't have to watch. Or gold? This is actually probably the place to be. If I want to skip copper and stuff, I just go straight to the jungle and get gold because it shows up here pretty good. All right. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to, you know, fart around the dungeon. Or not the dungeon. I'm going to fart around here for a while, not picking stuff up for some reason. Strange. Maybe someone will comment and know what's going on. Oh, eat that. Eat that mushroom. Um, I, cause I'm a little bit at a loss as to why I'm not picking stuff up always. Something's, something's not happy in my game. I'm that much I'm sure of. Something's upset. Oh, alright, so I picked that gold up. And there's another golden chest. Okay, well I'll show you the golden chest if I, if I can win this fight. Uh, if, if I can kill this guy. Let's put the torch down. Platforms and then start killing again. Yeah, if I can kill this guy, I'll show you the golden chest, and then I'll spend a bit of time down here gathering up um, some gold specifically. And I will meet you guys back probably at my house. Because um, I'm just going to be gathering some basic, basic, uh, what I get. Another Hermes boots. Wow. That's nice. Invisibility, Featherfall, Dynamite, even. Wow. All kinds of good stuff. 
So uh, that's kind of cool. I mean, uh, let's just drink everything. And uh, yeah, I'll bring it. I can sell it at the very least if we need money. So yeah, um, thing. No, I'm not gonna end the episode. I'm just gonna uh, go off camera for a bit. So I'll see you guys back once I've gathered up some gold and have enough for pickaxe, hopefully, just to save you guys some trouble. And welcome back to our little humble abode, folks. So it was a fairly successful trip. I didn't last all that long before I got killed, but I did manage to pick up two hearts. So that was good. And a uh, jungle rose. Ooh, it could be pretty. Uh, <laughs> um, but yeah, you know, it was pretty good. And I went and picked up some, uh, some stones. So I think I have enough now. Yeah, there we go. So I can make my furnace. I even have enough for an anvil already because of our good treasure chests. And we can make, um, let's make some bars. I think I have a couple from our first world. So I have some leftover stuff here. I actually got quite a lot of stuff. I'm not going to use jungle grass seed. Who cares about that? Um, I'll put those away. I've got a lot of, I've got a mess here. I definitely have a mess. Okay, iron, copper, iron ore. I must have iron ore, yeah. Silver ore. I don't know if I'll have enough gold for what I was hoping for. I didn't uh, I didn't live long enough to actually check that out. So um, maybe I can do the quick stack. Bam. Okay, so let's, uh, let's see how much we got. See if we got anything good. Oh, look, missiles. I knew we'd have to make missiles. Iron bars, gel, and torches. And you can make super missiles, which are including bombs. Ooh, that's going to be fun. I'm looking forward to that. But no missile launcher yet, so can't do it just yet. So uh, gold. 11 gold. Might be enough. Yeah, not enough. Am I like one short or something? Shoot. Um, what else do we need? Um, to smelt our other metals. Okay, we got quite a lot of silver. Silver went well. And must have some more iron. Alright, so that was a pretty good first haul. I mean, I don't think you generally do that well on your first cave trip. <laughs> Plus we got um, Hermes boots. That's lucky. I was happy about that. So I'm um, okay. I think I don't have enough gold, right? Um, let's just double check with the with the guy here. But I'm pretty sure it's like 12 or something. So uh, let's see if there's anything new. Also, uh, doesn't look like you need gold for anything new in in the Metroid log, as far as I can tell. Um, pickaxe 12, of course. I'm one short. That sucks. Um, Need to kill this slime before we get this. Alright, and this one. I dare you. Do you feel lucky? <laughs> um, okay, so you. Uh, what about silver? Is there anything from silver in the mod pack? Uh, super missiles. Okay, sil so super missiles need silver and bombs. And I can make a super missile recharge with the souls and all that. That's cool. Nice. Yeah, this is good. Alright. And um, what else do I need? Iron for anything? Mod related specifically? Um, all the normal stuff. Okay, so you can make doors maybe. I don't know if they work or not. But you need Soul of Lights. Missile, normal missile recharge with Souls of Light. Okay, that's not too hard to make in hard mode. Uh, and universal ammo. Okay, I don't know what that's for, but sounds cool. Alright, so um, basically that's the plan. We gotta get going. We gotta make new stuff. I'm going to make myself a silver pickaxe to replace our junky copper one. That's an upgrade. And um, you know I might make, how much silver I've got? 12 silver bars. I can make a hammer or an axe. Let's make an axe in case I need to chop down trees. Because I don't really need this stuff for very much other than uh, that. And I'll make an iron axe. No, not an iron axe. Shoot. That was a waste. Iron hammer. <laughs> That's what I meant to say. Alright, so that gives us a better uh, a starting equipment. This can be our chest for now. I need one more gold and then we can get a uh, better pickaxe. Uh, unless we just end up killing. Uh, I'm probably not going to do much potion stuff either. Stingers I'll keep. Cobwebs. Oh yeah, I could see if I have enough to make a bed. I probably don't yet. Jungle stuff. Oh man, there's just garbage everywhere. Everywhere garbage. Um, cobwebs, yeah, okay. And I need more lenses. Yeah, I wanted to try to get to that boss this episode, but I don't think I'm going to be able to. Um, chest in chest. Is that about it? Everything's cleaned up mostly? Alright, that's looking mostly alright. Got some bombs, so I'm going to need those. Blink root, whatever. Mushrooms. 
sands. I guess I could keep. I'm out of space. Whatever. <laughs> Messy Ankylo. Yeah, I know. I'll I'll sort this stuff out off camera. Or Bunnies. When did you get in my house? Samus doesn't like bunnies. Um, anyway, so yeah, we've got uh, an upgrade to our pickaxe, axe, and hammer, and we still need, um, still need, I didn't find the corruption, so to the left is the, um, I wonder if I'm strong enough to kill Skeletron already, actually. I wonder if I am. That'd be cool. You guys think I could kill Skeletron like this? Do you think I could even make it over this giant lake like this? Um, Skeletron, whatever they call him, you know. That seems like a good name. <laughs> okay, so the corruption is certainly this way, as you can probably tell. Very near to our house, so um, small maps are dangerous for that, I guess. I, I don't know, I just decided a small map would save us some time, probably. Alright, so that's close. Enough. And maybe something good in the chest? Bottles. Well, I can use them. Copper, I already don't really care about already. <laughs> Glow sticks, I guess, are kind of cool, and some money is okay. Potions, sure. We're pretty early on. We could use this stuff. Sure. All right, let's get out of here. Oh, I forgot to check if I can make my uh, make my uh, bed yet, but I probably need more cobwebs. All right, what do you guys think? Um, the jungle is on the left, so chances are Skeletron's on this side. Um, what I really need is to start breaking um, shadow orbs so that the meteorite starts to show up, because I definitely need meteorite for lots of stuff. Um, if you saw last episode, you saw the uh, recipes for the ball, the morphing ball, and actually I had a couple pieces of dynamite, but I forgot to bring them with me. Uh oh, Metroids! And uh, this might be the death of us, because I don't think I can kill them right now. Another chest! Oh, there's... Ah, they're after me! <laughs> no! <laughs> Metroids are coming! Uh oh, uh oh. Oh no. Oh, this is not a good spot to be without a grappling hook. <laughs> um... Well, there's a there's a shadow orb down there. Um, oh boy, this is this is really not a good place to be. I didn't get any hooks either when I was down there. So, um, okay. So, do I really have to uh, ledge jump myself out? Well, this is always exciting. Please feel free to fast forward a minute till I've jumped my way out of this pit. <laughs> okay, the corruption might not be the best place to be just yet. Um, for one, I can't actually, um, actually, you know, this is faster than the damn grappling hook anyway. Just, <laughs> um, if I could, oh, wait a second, really? That's the first time I've ever seen that happen. A shadow orb that was not protected. Crazy. Have you guys ever seen that before? That one's new for me. Right, well that was cool. Another shadow orb over there, but yeah, that's the one we saw. Whoa. Found a trap. <laughs> uh, good times, everybody. Good times. Oh, I gotta change this. Yeah, my uh, my bed, or my, my spawn point is right where I uh, built my house. <laughs> so every time I die. Uh, oops. So I got... Uh, I got killed by a trap. <laughs> Bonus points if you saw that before it exploded. Um, <laughs> that was good. All right, uh, Scott there, my buddy. Can you tell me if this gun is used in anything new? No, it's not a material. Okay, so it's not, it's no good, it's junk. But I will keep it just in case I feel like getting the guy to move in. Um, okay, so, <laughs> uh, well, this episode's been exciting. We made it to uh, a shadow orb and I guess, that means a meteorite could fall, um, so that's good, actually. I'm happy about that. Okay, so can I make uh, No, what do I need? I need a loom, but I need uh, a chain to make a loom, right? So then I need iron. I'm trying to remember all these recipes off the top of my head. It's uh, perhaps not my best strength. Can I not make... Oh, do I need... What am I thinking? I'm, I'm, I'm missing a step here. Oh no, there it is, chains. So I'm gonna make uh, a bunch of chains, because I'll need them anyway for my grappling hook one day. And now with wood, if I have enough, I can make a sawmill. Okay, do I need that? And with that, I can make a loom. Yeah, there's the loom, I'll right, put that on the roof. And with that loom, I can make uh, silk, right? Uh, or do I have to be up there? Oh, 
I don't have double jump yet. I can't get up easily. I missed my double jump. I miss all my cool abilities, actually. Okay, so I should... Yeah, there's the silk. I'll... I'll probably don't have enough. Okay. Get out of my house, stupid slimes. I know, I left the doors open. Alright, crafting, silk, how much do I need? Um... I need... And I've got enough! I've got enough already. Beautiful! We can already make our bed. If I had a place to put it. So, um... Bed. Bed! Woohoo! Um, where do we want to... I don't even have enough room. This is crazy. Um, let's just take this table out of here and this thing out of here. And from now on, we can spawn actually on a right place. Instead of any in the middle of nowhere. Alright, so, well, I mean, that's a pretty good episode. We got a bed. We found the... We, we spent some time in the jungle having a good time. And we, uh... We found our first shadow orb. Um, between episodes, I might... I don't know what I'll do. Maybe I won't do anything in between episodes. I'll just, uh, I'll keep live recording the majority of the play stuff for now. Until stuff starts feeling like, uh, the drag, you know. Anyway. So yeah, thanks for watching. Hope you've enjoyed. And, uh, hopefully next episode we can start working towards some new, uh, mod stuff. Because, um, we got a little ways to go. Still got to get those meteorites and get to the cat, get to the, uh, dungeon or something. So thanks for watching. Hope you've enjoyed. And have a great day.